that's uh, let start some work on this spider spawner. Because it's within range of our zombie spawner. So with this we can get a ton of string which is going to be really useful in conjunction with the giant bamboo farm I built. So let's start by clearing all this out. We need to create a 9x9 area. So 9x9 means out by 4 in every direction. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Make sure it's three blocks above the spawner so that we don't have any issues with them being blocked. So we need to go out of that one there. So now that we've cleared this area, so we've gone up by three blocks above there. Now we need to go down by four blocks. We're going to clear all this area out to make sure that the spiders can drop down. Now while you're mining like this, be very careful that you don't accidentally hit the spider spawner because that would be sad. And especially with a efficiency 5 netherite pickaxe with haste 2 beacon running, it's uh, very easy to slip and destroy now if you have gaps like this, just make sure you close them up because we don't want any of the spiders to be getting out of this area. have this area here and this side here is where we want the collection happening because that way there is the direction to the zombie villager trading center area so we're going to clear this row out and then grab a bucket of water and we're going to and we're going to put water all on this end and it will flow down there so doing a bit of further research we want to make sure that the floor is actually six blocks below. So turn that off. I've got two torches on here just in case. And we put a slab on because this is a spider spawner. So we're down by four. One, two, three, four. We need to go down two more. The reason for this, uh, so I was watching one of JC Play's uh, tutorials and he had it only down by four but then um, doing some further research you want it down by six so that the spiders actually will uh, leave the spawner mob cap which will improve your rates we have to push these down by one and we can put our water sources in and i think it needs to go one more there should be these four but we can test it out with our water buckets Now, if everything is flowing in a straight line, that means you've done your job properly. So let's put water on these ones here, and that will flow down. There we go. So that's our killing area there. So now we fill in this water source here, and then clear out all the blocks. And have a look how close this is. Here's our zombie powered trading hall under construction. All right, so we can fill in this area here because we're going to need there. So for ease of use, I want this to drop down to negative 45 because that will line up with the trading area and be all nice. 
and then let's dig ourselves. So we're going to need to break all these blocks out. So one further around. Sorry. One further around at both levels. Reason for this is because this is where we're going to be doing our trident killer. Now this direction here is where we're going to be AFK. So we've cleared out this area here. We're going to need four observers, four droppers, four pistons. We need a lever and some stairs and then some solid blocks. So the side that you want the collection to happen, you need an upside down stair there. And then the direct opposite. So there's gonna be, oh, let's put our pistons in first. Piston here, here, like so. So this is where this is where our AFK spot is going to be. Then this opposite direction, we're going to put an upside down stair in there. So now we put solid blocks the rest of the way around. This will stop things from glitching out, and we want to put an upside down stair this way so that we can get all the loot drops and everything next up let's put our droppers into the corners doesn't matter which way they face we want to get our observers and crouch and place them facing into the droppers but not on top of the pistons yeah like so and then fill in the remainder Fill in the remainder, so then you have an area that the spiders aren't going to glitch out of. All right, now we've got to get ourselves out of here. Didn't think that one through, did I? It's okay. We can always fill this block in later. And we put that into that stair there. This is so that the trident works. Get yourself a trident. Doesn't matter what level of damage is on it. Throw it. Add piston. So now we're going to break this area out a little. And this is where we're going to be standing with our looting three sword to catch all the. to get everything. So after building this, I've realized that I have dropped it down too low. So I match nicely with the pathway but I, where I was standing no spiders, spiders were spawning so I'm going to raise this up let's go to there so make sure you don't do it too low
So now we have a working spider spawner processing factory. I hope you've enjoyed this one and I will see you in the next one.